everybody. Make a little quick update video. I'll be getting a lot of questions. About my Harley. Some people have seen it on Instagram that I had some more problems with it the other day. The fact is I did. Uh, last week I was on my way home from work. I even actually had a uh, Facebook Live video going. And uh, if you're watching that video, you'll see me start looking down a lot. Yeah, I'm looking down at the back wheel because uh, I noticed I, there was something going on. I could feel it. It was feeling real draggy, feeling real wobbly, like real bad, and I uh, quit the Facebook video, and I mean, it was like 10 seconds after I clean, quit that video, and it's actually right up here, yeah, right here where there's a wall on the other side of the road, right there, my uh, rear caliper ended up locking up again, brought me to a screeching halt. I was probably running around around 75, somewhere around an air. I was in the middle lane. I was able to slide to the shoulder. I had a feeling that's what was going on. So, luckily enough, there was a guy that was behind me in a truck. He uh, he was able to stop with me. He ended up passing me and backing up to me. Had some tools. We were able to bleed the pressure off so I could finish getting it home. But the whole way home, I had this really bad wobble. I was like, okay, well, I fucked the rotor up. The rotor's warped, and now it's rubbing real bad. It's wobbling like this. I mean, like, really, really bad. So I uh, ended up buying a new uh, caliper, put it on. Bought a new rotor, put it on. And uh, when I got everything put on, my back brake was still locked up for some reason. So I ended up draining the whole system, blew the lines out with compressed air, and uh, but when I opened up my reservoir for my master cylinder, I noticed there's a bunch of little black pieces of shit in there. So my guess is my brake line is still stock brake line, and it's probably de deteriorating from the inside, and I'm getting shit in it, and it probably uh, blocked my return point return port to my master cylinder would let the fluid release the damn brake and it finally just locked up. But the other problem was after I put it all back together and wrote it and figured out uh, the caliper was still locked up, took it back and jacked it back up on my jack. I was like, well, I didn't, I still noticed I had the wobble too. I like, why do I still have the wobble? Well, ended up taking the wheel back off again and my fucking back left wheel bearing was completely shot like well that sucks like like the balls out of the bearing had came some of them had came out that's how bad it was so and I'm not gonna lie I'm pretty hard on this fucking bike the street racing it and everything I do to it and I never once thought to even check that Probably should service this damn thing a lot better than what I do. I mean, I thought I think I do a pretty good job, but I don't know. Come on, you fucking cocks, get out of the way! So, anyways, you know, just a little quick update video. She's running again. Brand new wheel bearings, brand new caliper, brand new rotor. <laughs> With the master cylinder, the rear brake master cylinder and everything, I got about $500 wrapped up in this back fucking wheel. So, hopefully it'll last me a while. Need to pay more attention to everything. One thing I don't like is the old bearings were sealed bearings. The new bearings are shielded bearings, which means they're greasable. The problem is they're not sealed, so now they're subject to weather. 
So gonna have to keep a lot of grease in them just to get a good amount of life out of them. I mean, hell, the old ones got 10,000 miles out of them and I doubt if I get that out of these because they're, they're not sealed and I have no way to protect them. It's, it's all open, so that bugs me, but it is what it is. So yeah, nothing exciting about this video, just a quick update video because a lot of people have been asking me what happened. <laughs> <laughs> make a quick one let everybody know what happened and uh call it good so yeah, that's pretty much it i'll catch y'all later